Hello everybody, Mike Arnold here, co-founder of Patrick and Partners along with Bob Iacchino. Coming back, pretty much closing on our uh, 6562 gain level just below it. After dipping down close to 200, did not hold the rotation back up. Remember we are saying watch for a close below it, close below it. So that takes us out of this potentially bullish move, puts us back in neutral. And again, we're back in the same range, back in consolidation. Nothing to do. No targets have changed. Uh... No major targets have changed. You can do minor targets if you wanted to, if you're looking for, if we do sell off again, those would be your minor targets, 64.85, then 64.57. Other than that, nothing really to look at. Let's check on the daily chart. Just giving you an update on the rotation zone again. Can't, couldn't hold the first cross, couldn't hold this either. Closed actually back, well this hasn't closed yet, but closed, trading back at the eight. So watch where this closes, if it can close above the 6,600. That is, uh, it's still neutral, but it's slightly more to bullish side. If it closes below that, it's slightly more to the bearish side. We're just sitting on our hands. There's uh, no high probability p patterns. It just failed the next rotation back up. Can't seem to get any traction out of here. So again, we're watching the bigger picture to see if it breaks up or breaks down, and then we'll trade that way accordingly. Looking at Ethereum, Ethereum also could not hold the rotation up, closing below the uh, bottom of the rotation zone. Coming to the 50, then the 50 became resistance. Now it might turn back into support. Rotation zone is completely flat. Same thing with Ethereum, nothing to do. You could always do a reverse GAN box if you're looking for the next lower levels. There's the reverse GAN box. So if we do break down below uh, 222, 222, 222, if I can say it right, then we'd be looking at 219.65, then a cluster at two, essentially 218 to 218.31. We also have the uh, flat 200 in there. Checking in on the daily. It's also in consolidation. Nothing really to do. Again, sit on our hands and wait to see if it gets above on a closing basis. Uh, 233 is going to be critical to the upside on a closing basis and on a bearish basis closing really i'm going to say down below this a uh, 211 212 area so we have you on ethereum and bitcoin rather boring markets right now and we'll talk to everyone soon bye for now